So early zero to two weeks after uh, dislocation or surgery, price. So protect it from risk of further damage. We don't really want to put them in a, a splint unless they need uh, to have something to enable them to move. And even then it should be a, not a cricket splint, but something that allows them to move freely. So uh, rest to help with the effusion with sort of, um, but not bed bound certainly. Ice, a little bit of compression, elevation. Ice massage too, if they've got um, op sites with waterproof dressings. And if it's simply a, uh, a dislocation, not surgery, ice massage around the medial patellofemoral ligament can be useful too. Crutches only if needed to normalize gaits and um, only a liaise with the surgeon if they've had surgery uh, as to what, what the weight bearing status should be. Pain-free quads don't start driving further inhibition, start statically, avoid open chain inner range. So don't do the classic post or exercise of pillow under the knee, hinging into terminal extension. That's massively stressful on the, on the patella. Range of movement as pain allows. So if they've had surgery, do check with the surgeon as to what they're happy with. Get their glutes firing and working potentially probably easiest open chain initially inside lying and prone calf loading could do some seated calf raises initially and as I've said initially really try and avoid going down the bracing route unless surgically the surgeon is insisting and it's required there's no uh, literature to support the use of bracing <laughs>